I think this is probably the most exciting time in the 91 year history of the Port of Corpus Christi. We are the energy port of the Americas. If you drive a car, if you fly in a plane, if you're riding a train, if you own a boat, most likely the fuel that you're putting into those vehicles is made right here in Corpus Christi. Today, the Port of Corpus Christi is the largest exporter of U.S. produced crude in the nation. We are uh, a premier port for wind cargo. We have it all. We have the infrastructure. We have the capacity to be able to efficiently move these components to their destinations. You can see the energy. You can see the port. You can see the ships. You can see things being unloaded, whether it's wind turbines or, or crude oil being loaded out. You can physically feel the energy of this port. Today we're talking the sums of billions. We have $50 billion worth of capital investment coming into the Port of Corpus Christi as we speak. What we're seeing here is larger than the investment in most states. Companies come here from China, from Italy, from Austria, from Mexico. All those companies are coming here and investing their dollars in the United States and in Texas and Corpus Christi. This place is not about to, it is already exploding. Our core team, they're all looking at what's the next step for Corpus Christi. How can we make it better 20 years down the line for a new clientele to come in? Well, we have a 10-year capital program that, that's $1 billion. The enormity of some of the projects, the number of projects, the diversity of those projects are just tremendous. We're building more docks. We're building a deeper channel to be able to handle the new classification of vessels. We're building a taller bridge so those new vessels can get underneath the new bridge. We're one of the few ports in the country that can handle three class one railroads. And we have just quadrupled our capacity. We're going from just another port in the Gulf to the premier port in the Gulf.